With Christopher McVeigh back from suspension and slotting in for Mati Peltola, who only recently returned from international duty. So too does Patrick Ajiman, Liel Abada, and Karol Schwiderski, the two players who dropped to the bench. The ball is kicked into play. All eyes on Audi Field on decision day. I'm lit, man. This is exactly what you want to be doing, and that's playing for your fate in decision day. And here's Christian Benteke through on goal. Benteke kicks save from Kalina. Those two will most definitely be the protagonists tonight. This is good. Stroud. Benteke! Oh. Couldn't strike it cleanly. That could have been a show-stopping moment from the Belgian. The ball behind Vargas. Takes a peek and wants to take on Herrera. Delivers that one! Orso. Untracked, but straight up on him. Pirani, he can release Benteke. He does. Here's Christian Benteke! Season one, but the flag was raised. Yep, he is clearly offside here. But what you need to understand is hitting the back of the net sometimes, even if it doesn't count, it does help your momentum. Bronico in the half space. Vargas. That's a delightful cross, Ajiman. A little bit too much swerve on that header. We'll go unpunished for now as Pirani is on the ball. Stroud pulls the trigger! Oh. But they're so well allocated in the box that they can defend pretty much anything that DC United has thrown to them up to this point in time. Can they keep that up? Biel. Achiman. Couldn't get enough on it. Or arm. Referee had a good angle. And now a breakaway here for Charlotte. It could be a two on one. Brent Bronico. Charging forward, here's Brad Bronico. Bronico to Pepe! Bullseye! Against the run of play, Charlotte FC have taken the lead at Audi Fields. And the enthusiasm, the life, and this is exactly why you have to keep your foot on the gas up here, DC United. They came out of the gates in the second half very slow. Charlotte's picked their moment and has punished them. Pepe the new designated player has really come into life here in his last eight games. He's been absolutely excellent. He gets his second goal on the season, and this man is a very well welcome player to Dean Smith's side. He picks his moment. He's risen his enthusiasm in this second half, slots it home, and says, yes, I got more than ice in my veins. I have the ability to make sure that we are slamming the door shut on D.C. United. 1-0 in the nation's capital. Burn. Oh, that's well done for Through Burn. Through to Pepiel, who's got two runners. Vargas to his left. Here's Kervin Vargas. Vargas rifles that one straight up on him, who makes the save. Getting away from Nathan Byrne with smoke and mirrors. Click into Ooh. Benteke. Benteke's through! But the flag raised once again. The eye test to me, he looked to be offside, and we're going to see here. It's close, but no, it's not close. He's about two yards and a step and a half offside. And what you have to understand... Bidani. Left it too short. Tim Ream. Look at Brent Bronico go. He's onside. He's the recipient. He has Ajiman to his right. Here's Patrick Ajiman! And Patrick Ajiman! Buries it! Once again in transition. ...about this game is one that they will be extremely happy about. Again, when they break this down in the film room, they'll be excited. Brent Bronico gets out. He's a very willing runner. Gets behind Herrera there, who again does not stay home. Tim Ream has the understanding just to curl that ball with a lot of culture behind the right back there. And Patrick Ajima does exactly what you're supposed to do. You get on the other side of the two center backs. So just a very cultured ball into your step is... That finishing punch there. Phone home. Leal Abada to Vargas. Vargas!
touches. A quick step over. If DC United do crash out of playoff contention, if they don't make it, some people might call this a bottle oh. job. A oh, watch out. Here's Liel Abada. Abada oh. slapped away by Bono. And look how open Carol Schwiderski is. Oh. He's off to the races. He has Jamie Patterson to his left. Here's Patterson! A whisker white! Or foresaw this happening may have been Charlotte FC because the way they went about the first half, they were excellent defending. They Hold knew that they were going to get their Leal opponents. Abada. Squeezed out initially. Away from Herrera. Abada! Done and dusted. To get to look at Abada. He does excellently to make sure that he puts this ball to recycle himself where only he can get it. Trudersky. But here they are again, completely exposed. Trying to add insult to injury. Brett Bronico. Oh. That wasn't far from top bins. Tom Baji latching onto this one. Denied by Christian Kalina, who wants to hold on to this clean sheet. DC United will be out if it stands. They're in. My goodness. Well, the curtain comes down at Audi Fields. A comprehensive win for Charlotte FC, who claimed fifth spot. DC United may very well be out of the playoffs. We haven't determined that yet.